Seattle Tacoma International Airport. We want your journey to be a safe one for all members of your Once on board, please place your larger item only in the overhead space. Please step in. Do not block the aisle so we can continue with our boarding. You're good. We had a uh, one of our nose foot tires had a piece lodged into it, so uh, they had to either pull it out or change the tire. We don't know yet. Um, anyway, it should be done hopefully here uh, fairly quick, and uh, after that, is some paperwork and to make sure everything was correctly done. Uh, we appreciate your patience, and uh, let me know if you have any questions. Thank you getting notifications we are rebooking just because the connection time is going to be too short in denver if you choose to stay on your original flight and you want to try and run it when you get to denver we get we can't guarantee that you'll make that flight but if you do want to stay on your original flight and we've already changed you we can change you back or if we haven't changed you, you want to stay on your original flight if you're connecting to dallas um, just press your flight attendant call button and then i'll come around and get your names that way we can keep you on your original flight or we can change you back to your original flight. Uh, that's if you're connecting uh, uh, in Denver going to Dallas. Um, if you want to get rebooked for that next available flight, just so you don't have to worry about running and trying to catch that next gate, um, then you don't have to do anything. I'm just gonna go get names of people that wanna stay on their original flight or wanna get put back on that original flight and try to run into that gate when you get there. Just keep in mind, if we're not changing it here and you don't make it to that gate, then you'll uh, need to see customer service in Denver. They'll have to do that for you in Denver. So again, if you're connecting in Denver, going to Dallas, and you want to stay on your original flight, or if we changed you and you want to go back to that original flight, just press your flight attendant call button and I'll come by and get your uh, names. Uh, fault is taken clear of. Uh, it was up to, uh, we didn't have to change the tire. It was uh, the piece of metal was not stuck far enough into the tire. That was an issue. So it's all taken care of. Paperwork is done. Uh, we should be on our way here in a couple more minutes. Thank you. Hold on. To fasten your seatbelt, slide the flat end into the buckle. Pull the loose strap to tighten to release. Lift up on the buckle. Position your seatbelt tight and low across your hips and wear it any time that you are seated.
there's some tight connections. I'm going to try to get more information on it to see if those connections are going to be able to be made. As of now, it looks like it's going to be real tight. But like I said, I'm going to get further information on it. I'll uh, let you guys know. Also, I'm looking for a few passengers that I have some information or actually some stuff for you that uh, Seattle wanted to get to you guys, but we had a hurry to take off once this was fixed, so they didn't have time. So if you hear your name being called, if you can go ahead and just ring your flight attendant call button.